and we welcome to the Prince Magnum channel where hot rotting and romance do coexist. I'm your host, Prince Magnum. Welcome once again to Do It Yourself Budget Hot Rotting. And I know in this episode, we were actually supposed to do the rear brakes on Project Lena. However, whoever worked on them last put them on in a way where it was next to impossible. Hey, what's going on, Sean? Put them on next to impossible where you cannot, you cannot get them loose. Even I tried and I couldn't get those brakes loose, so she's got to go to a shop. However, that does not mean that you ladies out there and guys who enjoy seeing a woman work on a car is not going to get to enjoy this, okay? Princess Faye is going to do some work on both projects today, okay? She's right there. (laughs) <laughs> what are you doing? Oh my God! I was just the people. Sean's already in the live. He was waiting for this. Okay, so so here in just a second, we're gonna turn the camera around, and Princess Faye is gonna go to work on Project Lena, and she's gonna work on Project Spirit at the same time. Jump scare! <laughs> Hashtag jump scare. That's easy for me to get jump scared. I, I'm, I scared myself at work yesterday. I dropped some boxes and I screamed bloody murder. Hey, think difference here. Awesome, awesome. You guys are gonna love this. Like I said, initially we were gonna do the back brakes, but it just wasn't gonna happen today. So we are going to uh, do some work to the cars. Well, I say we, but it's gonna be Princess Faye. So you guys are still gonna get your your woman working on a car, okay? So for our ladies out there that are probably gonna be showing up here pretty soon, that's exactly what they're gonna get, okay? So let's uh, hit a button. Ta-da, there is none other than Project Lena. And Hood's already up, we're getting ready to start tearing into this bad girl. And uh, honey, go ahead. First thing I know she's gonna do is she probably, well, she's going to open up some shop towels. I think my mom's going to probably jump in on this one, too. Your mama's going to jump in on this? I told her about it. Okay. So. Now, I might be doing a few things, but it's going to be mostly Princess Faye. It is nice weather out for a change. Not a cloud in the sky, really, to speak of, except over there. But other than that, that's about it. Okay. Just going to go ahead and check the oil. Is it registered low? Okay, go ahead and... You know I what? Guess I should probably show that. Huh? Yeah, go ahead. I'm used to being on camera. See, the oil stops right there. I want it over here. Okay. Well, it's still in the safe air zone, but that is low. Yeah, it's weird how they did that. I hurt myself. Already, it's going to be a tough stream of just taking a cap off her. <laughs> You're going to be fine, babe. 5W30, what the factory calls for for this engine? Don't run away on me, Dowell. Excuse me, Mom. Might as well. If you haven't already, be sure to smash that like button. Hashtag car girls, right? I did break my rule of smoking a little bit on camera. How dare you? I know it. Hey, do we have any 
Upstairs in the office. Brake fluid is a little low, so she's got to bring it up to that marker there. So I'm going to step out of the way. Oop. Sorry. I'm bound determined to fall on my face. Oh, this is a brand new bottle. Yep. It won't take all of it. It'll take a little bit of it, though. <laughs> Sean, clear weather usually means high air traffic, hint, hint, <laughs> aircraft remover. Alrighty, brake fluid's done. How are we looking? Coolant. Release thy cap, coolant. Thank you. Not great. Oh, Sean likes your hat. You're fine. You're fine, baby. Hey, what's going on, Gavin John? Welcome to the live, my friend. Uh, Princess Faye is doing a little bit of tinkering with both of the project cars. Take my cat back. You gotta kind of push it on there a little bit. You know how it is. You on there. I got it. So, <laughs> right over here, Gavin, you're gonna love this. This is Project Lena, Princess Faye's project car. So, this is it. And uh, she's basically kind of topping off the uh, topping off the fluids, making sure everything is hunky dory. And once she's done here, we're gonna start up uh, Project Lena, let her run a little bit, and then right over here is none other than Project Spirit, my 1975 Ford Maverick that is still daily driven. You're gonna love this. Okay, so we're gonna come back over here. Did you just check power from steering? Oh, yeah. I just wanted to make sure. It's fine. It's fine? Okay. It's okay. So, initially, we were going to do the back brakes today, but we could not even get I any of the back brakes I'm loose. I'm going to do something we didn't anticipate. What's that, baby? I want to check my air filter. Oh, It's been a couple months. For those of you guys who like to see a woman working on a car, I don't mind it. I enjoy it. <laughs> Well, the heck with them. That still looks practically brand new. Well, no, where is she's due for about a change. I'm go a little bit longer. You think? I'm gonna spend the money on something a little bit more pressing. Okay. Yet. I always ask every stream, how is everybody? Okay, how is everybody? How's everybody doing in, uh, today? Hopefully safe and sound and feeling very well. Why did you do that? What'd it do? It's just not where I want it. It's fine. It doesn't hurt. Okay. 
Everything look okay? You hunt, uh, everything okay? Yeah, yeah. Okay. I'm, fine. I'm just looking. Kind of worried me there. No, I'm just. There, there's a. I forget what it is. I think it's transmission fluid. Is down there. And I didn't realize how close it was. I thought it was further down. I'm not going to check that because I don't want to put my hand on there. Okay. Well, I know all the guys are wanting to hear. Fire up. What do you guys think? Purrs like an angel cat. That's Sean. Purrs like, like an angel cat? Yep. I think that was it. I need one more thing to fill up on food. Yeah. It's mine, don't worry. <laughs> <laughs> My food. Mm. Hashtag not sponsored. <laughs> <laughs> Hashtag not sponsored. I like that, babe. So you yeah, guys, this is Project. Uh, this is none other than Project Lena. So we'll get a good side shot of her. Best we can get. What? Oh, here, yeah. So the yeah, Princess Faye actually. It's um. She fixed the power, uh, the window herself. My um. The frick is it called? <coughs> tent. My tent is ruined. But that's okay. I was gonna change it anyways. my favorite glass cleaner. I know. We got it. I'm talking to you. I'm talking to my friends. Okay, that's uh, your after, that's your before. See the difference? Oh, brand new uh, seat covers. That's the point, my friend. Spotless.
Check that out, guys. Uh-oh. I see where she's going. I see where she's going now. Go ahead. Remember what else I needed to do to Lena? What was it after I checked her oil? You better go tell. Is I done yet? No. Go check. Shushy. You read comments. <laughs> Sean's laughing. She looks so unamused. <laughs> That's what John said. She looks so unamused. Now, real quick, if Gavin John is nearby, he'll be appreciative of this. You're looking at the original engine that's just been dolled up and had a little fancy work done to it. But internally, this engine has not changed since 19, November of 1974. So this is still the original engine, all original miles. Ready, Freddy? Go ahead. She's due for an oil change. Also really low. Yeah, go ahead and put that cord in, she'll be fine. That's probably about as much as I get to do in this stream. Now, if it's on there a little funky, I know you haven't messed with it in a little bit. Yeah. What else did you want me to check on her? Any freeze. Just because I'm scared of it doesn't mean I ain't going to do it. Husband abuse. <laughs> oh, Release thy lid. You got to push down. Any freezes in the in the car? Here, I can get that. Mm, it's That's an old radiator. Nothing. 
Uh, just fill it up just to the the spot right here is all you got to do. Just right there. Drink. Hand up. She's gonna take it all, isn't she? Just about. That's okay. We can do that in another stream. I don't want to change my phone. <laughs> I don't blame you. Awesome. There you go. It doesn't matter which way it faces. As long as it fits into those slots and then you push down and cap it tight. Now real quick, for those who do not know, this is what we call a pressurized cap. This did not come factory. I don't know why they don't do this from the factory. But basically, this, this uh, radiator will build up pressure. So when you have to check the fluid, when, if she's overheating, you just take and uh, flip that up. It releases the pressure, and you're less likely to have it blow out on your hands. Yep, that's why we have that on here. It's a safety precaution. It's an aftermarket safety precaution that every vehicle should have in some way, shape, or form. I think you just changed. Yeah, I just did that in a stream. Violet, please, thank you. You're good. You did a good job changing that. I'm proud of you. Yeah, I didn't fuck it up. Unlike last time. I didn't fuck it up last time. Always in denial. Huh? Always in denial. Stop going to Egypt without me. <laughs> So what do you guys think? Oh, leave it up, leave it up. Yeah. You're gonna take the camera. My turn. You're still in charge of the stream. Are you, are you? oh boy. Okay guys. She just took the keys from me. Oh, here real quick. Just installed the brand new C cover. There you go. All right, baby. Let her fly. Remember, she's in gear. Why would you have to say that? Now I'm scared of it again. <laughs> <laughs> Sean's doing the Batman theme. Did you take her out of gear already? Neutral, yeah, you got to put it in neutral. Straight down towards you, remember? Yeah, there you go. Now you don't have to hold in the clutch. 
You're right. You're so smart and stuff. I don't drive, man. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, you do. You just don't do it often enough to think about it. What? What are you doing? That's ignition key. You, yeah. You have too many keys, dog. <laughs> Remember the little ones? That's for the gas cap. This is the way up. That's correct. Here, here. There, that's your starting No! Yeah. Find my key. Why do you do that? <laughs> it's okay. I know. Mm -hmm. She hasn't done this in a little while. Go for it. Are you done? Filming. <laughs> Too much banter in this one. What? Too much banter in this one. <laughs> right. Spirit. You like all the dang switches and everything. Got my keys all jacked. Oh, no, I'm teasing with you. I will punch you on <laughs> camera. Do not think that I won't. <laughs> I got one more thing to do to. Um... What, Dad? Oh, yeah, yeah, I guess you do. And then we got another thing to do in spirit. Mm hmm. Yeah, they, everyone said they were doing fine. I see Sean and I know Gavin uh, was in. I don't know if he's still in or not. Yeah, that was when your belt was going bad. We've been going for a half an hour. Think difference here. I think different. He's been here. I 
Yeah, we got we got some lurkers. Well, they need to quit lurking and start participating. And and there's an excellent chance that your mom may be in. Hi, excellent chance of mom. Drop your phone. Yeah, um, we had a belt that was going bad, and it did that. Without tripping over everything. Before. It was kind of rattling some stuff around. Mm-hmm. Just get the worst of it so we can still see if it's doing it. Because I got something that'll take care of that. Actually, it's already out here. You're use the brake yeah, you're probably better off hitting with brake cleaner, honey. Holy crap, guys, check it out. We got a storm blowing in. Dang. Really cool. <laughs> I always forget how bad that stuff smells. But then it smells good. Because all my nose hairs have turned away. <laughs> if you haven't yet, be sure to hit the like button on this. Actually, I think everyone pretty well likes it. No, no, no. Just spray it directly on, baby. Not going to hurt nothing. Okay. It's hurt here, here. If I may suggest, you stand back because it's got a long stream. Does it? Whoa, it does. This stuff evaporates? Yes. It won't hurt a thing. There you go. Thank you. You're welcome, honey. That... That's really about all I get to do. She takes tools and everything away from me. Well, let me do what I'm good at. No, I'm teasing. <laughs> I'm waiting for Sean to do. Hey, what's going on, the amazing LSB? Well, you all get to see what my wife can do. She's been tinkering around with the cars. And notice I said... This is her project car. This is Project Lena, if you remember. Her 2003 Pontiac Grand Am GT. And then right over here is none other than Project Spirit, my 1975 Ford Maverick four-door sedan and original inline, uh, inline six, the inline 250. Over here, we have a 3.4 liter GM V6. Front wheel drive, rear wheel drive. Automatic transmission, three speed standard transmission. You guys, again, there are some differences between the cars, but both are pretty cool in their own little way. Princess Faye's been doing some cleaning and tankering and just kind of doing what she does which she could do a lot more. Initially, we were going to change the back brakes, but we could not get those bolts loose. Wanted to show you guys uh, at least one side, but no, nah, this car is going to have to go to the shop. They put it on there, and I think it's been numerous years since those brakes have been changed because I do see aftermarket parts. Rust, yeah, Rust will do it too. And uh, I just cannot get it loose. Even I can't break it loose. You so even hit that, um, hit it with some, like, uh, Penetrating oil. Yeah. Yeah, man, it just wouldn't do it. Stop evaporating so quickly. Yeah, glad you guys are all here. Because, again, this is a woman we're, uh, doing, you know, doing work. Stop calling me a woman. Then what are you? 
I don't want to be judged. So could PB Blaster. Yeah, I've got the off-brand version of that, and it just wouldn't, do, and a torch. Yeah, I thought about that. Uh, amazing LSB says, a very pretty woman. Whatever, come on. Annoyed with Brent Cleaner. I'm that right now, that's for sure. Peanut butter blaster? No, 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 no. <laughs> that would be cool if there was such a thing. What? PB blaster, it's a type of penetrating oil, and then he said hit it with a torch. We don't have a torch, or otherwise this... We live up there. So that's the problem. We don't have a whole lot of room for everything. <laughs> I want to buy a house, but YouTube's taking its time. Yeah, YouTube's taking its time with the. Uh... But the live streams have been going exceptionally well. We've had a lot of people in. I do feel more comfortable being on camera now. I'm sure that makes you happy. Yes. You're going to have to, you already know, your windshield. What? What about my windshield? Uh, it's got some of the brake cleaner on it now. Oh, I, I want to hit all the windows eventually tonight anyway, so that's fine. I already anticipated cleaning the windshield. <laughs> just every time I pop the hood and I see the strip, it makes me sad. So I just want to take care of it. How do you think I feel with the rust and everything on mine? Yours has an excuse. It's 40 freaking thousand years old. Mine's oh, you made 4,290 watch hours? Heck yeah. Great job. Good for you. You just don't want to monetize? Why not? Eh? You Thank should, you man. Good. You earned it. Who is this? The amazing LSB. Heck yeah. Bruh. Since I'm not on camera, I can do this. As promised, I will try not to smoke these on camera, but since I am not on camera. <laughs> you honorary cuss. I love you too, babe. <laughs> oh sean smoker we got a smoker here <laughs> and then he says uh oh you quit last year lsb he quit smoking last year what oh you want the that was a the only the third thing i get to do in this stream i don't know if he meant that but that was a left for dead reference right was that uh -huh. a left for dead reference please tell me that was a left for dead reference I really hope that was a lot for Brand new? Brand new. Mm -hmm. shake, 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 shake. You don't have to shake it. I want to shake it. Yes, dear. Oh, God. <laughs> <laughs> Let me get back here. Go ahead. <laughs> you don't like brand new things. I know. I know they are. That's why we got them. I actually bought these last year. That's gonna be okay. Yeah, it's gonna be fine, honey. Okay. Coming for you if it ain't. <laughs> uh, amazing LSB. And if she likes Left for Dead, keep her uh, times 100. <laughs> <laughs> Why do you think I married her? Uh, I'm gonna throw you under the bus now. You, uh, Magnum's never played Left for Dead. <laughs> so? <laughs> I'm evil. <laughs> I'm kidding. I love you. I love you too. You know I you know I ain't gonna do anything mean to you. Bow chicka bow wow. Yeah, I'm sorry. You'd like it, Prince Magnum. That's awesome. Honestly, you would. I really think you would. Yeah, you were right. I was going to You know why you 
so dirty. I did not anticipate this taking so Uh, the two liter bottle of Pepsi? That's what Princess Faye is drinking. What was the question? What was the two liter bottle for? <laughs> she drinks way too much soda. It's why I look like a potato. I'd say that's good, babe. Yeah, like I said, I didn't anticipate it actually taking as long as this. I thought it was going to be and then done. Yeah, I'm like you. I drink way too much coffee. So we got to go do spirits cleany thing now. That'll be a lot easier since it's Amazing LSB says co uh, soda and coffee is his only vices. Coca-Cola started making me sick, so I had to switch to Pepsi. Okay, come with me, people. Don't call coffee a vice. <laughs> Love it. We're just going to clean the black. <laughs> Coffee's not a vice, it's a staple. <laughs> Oh, that's uh, somebody's tractor off in the distance over there. Very nice homes over that way. Hey, what's going on, Queen Bee? I was wondering if you'd make it. Princess Faye's already done some tinkering on her car right there. And now she's uh, touching up Project Spirit's taillight panel, cleaning it, making sure that everything looks good. Yep, it looks like a taillight panel. Do, 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 do. <laughs> Just chilling out. Again, Princess Faye basically did the painting on that. Good to see everybody here. Wish my sis would have came in. She did like this. Oh, Queen Bee wants to help. You want to help? Let me know if I miss a spot. Uh, we're touch up tips. Uh, just love. Yeah, <laughs> Hannah hashtag can't hang. Oh man, I'm gonna tell my sister you said that. <laughs> uh touch up tips mostly right now we're just kind of this is a uh, this is part of the touch up seeing if there's any scuffs that we may have missed uh anything like that which i did see one spot i wasn't 100 percent happy with right there you can kind of see where the old paint just didn't stick so we're gonna have to pop that lock out and redo it right there. Hey, Gotons is here. No, 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 yeah, don't touch. I just cleaned that. Mess up my work. Yes, dear. Go Tons, my wife has been uh, basically tinkering with our project cars. And uh, she just got through uh, kind of cleaning the dust off of Project Spirit's uh, taillight panel that we did in that one video. So if you've not seen it, my wife actually painted this panel herself. 
We took it, uh, the both of us took it down to the bare metal. He'll love the response. Uh, the trunks and floors are actually solid as a rock still. And uh, we are... No, we're not even close to what she's going to look like yet. Uh, we're looking at uh, the summer. Once the, the weather stops doing this all the time, we're going to start looking at doing the body work. I'm actually going to take uh, about a week off from work. And... Uh, <laughs> Yeah, not uh, not bad for being a Missouri car. Um, what, dear? I've made a mistake. What did you, what? I sat down like this. Hey, what's going on? Daniel, welcome to the live, my friend. Oh, it's supposed to know where you are, queen. Yeah, for being a Missouri car, there's only three real big rust spots while you're touching up. I'll come back. Right there, a lot. You better be careful, okay? Uh, right down there, there's a couple of little spots right up here around the bezels. Right over there. And then right back here, that's the most rust that Spirit actually has. Yeah, typical on the rear uh, on the rear ends. Yeah, and it was all actually it was uh it had a lot of surface rust. Yeah, she didn't come that way. Remember, car a lot of cars back in the day didn't side mirror. Oh, but that's her tail light panel that Princess Faye and I we took her down to the bare metal, got rid of all the surface rust. Do you want to do an oddly satisfying part? What? Okay. I hope nobody screams at this. Okay. Princess Faye is going to take uh, the old pinstriping off that she put on there because she wants to do something different to it. Right, right. Good to see you, Daniel. <laughs> right, right, Sean. There you go. She sat for uh, 20 years and was being worked on for about four to five years. Her original family was trying to put her back on the road, but they kept having tragedy strike. Uh, yeah, she sat in a barn for about 20, uh, 20 years and sat in the garage for a little while. Now, this particular car, what we do know about Project Lena is the fact that uh, Project Lena was owned by a guy who had some uh, legal troubles, and uh, I, we're believing he sold her, and she ended up at, back at a used car dealership um, so he could pay for his legal troubles. And the reason why we know that is because we, we found, found some of papers in the uh, glove box. Yep. Getting them started is the hardest part because my nails are paper. Yeah, real quick, for those that aren't familiar, right now, Princess Faye, my beautiful wife, is actually doing uh, this work herself. I mean, and real quick, now I know Think Different is going to be while you're work, uh, getting that started. You're going to love this. The pinstriping that's on the hood. And down along the sides of Spirit, that is not factory. That is not factory. Princess Faye put that on. My wife did the pinstriping on my car. Just take that in a moment. 
I know Queen B is already like, oh man. Got it? Okay, go for it. <laughs> I think different likes Project Spirit a little bit more, but I'll tell you right now, Project Lena is actually in really good shape for a uh, for a 2003 Pontiac Grand Am GT. With 200,000 miles. Yeah, with 200,000 miles. She's actually in really good shape. Most of the time, these cars have been rode hard and put away wet. <laughs> That's how you get a car that falls apart on you. That's true. <laughs> Sean, giggity. <laughs> That's true. You do not see the Maverick often anymore. And I'll give you guys, uh, once we get close to the end of this stream, I'll give you guys some details on uh, the project cars that'll blow your mind, uh, on Project Spirit that'll blow your mind. Ta -da. Well, that's pretty well about it. We're just going to go upstairs and chit chat for a bit. You did an amazing job as always, babe. So there you have it. Real quick. Because I know there's some uh, some of the guys who are going to love this. All right. If Daniel, if you're still in here, take a look. Project Spirits, original, original, in line six. Coming up on 300,000 all original miles. The artwork you see is none other than that beautiful woman's work right over there. My wife painted that herself. <laughs> You've been rolled a few times. <laughs> As a matter of fact, Princess Faye has changed the spark plugs in Project Spirit a couple of times. Oh, you want to see the odometer? We just put this in today. Please note, back in the day, 100,000 miles was a lot of miles. So the odometer, <laughs> yeah. This is the this is the seat cover that Jim and John sent us, and uh, they went back into uh, they went into the project cars. Oh, you're a purple kind of guy. Well, this is actually the factory color for her interior. This is factory. Oh yeah, we're keeping the bench. Uh, because, uh, here, I'll show you. Let me turn the camera around, and I'll explain why we're keeping the bench. Okay, let me climb in. The reason why we, we're keeping the bench is so I could do stuff like this. Princess Faye sitting next to me. I put my arm around her. Oh, the rear seats? A little dirty back there, but that's it. Not bad, really. Getting to some tears that are right up there. And the carpet you see back there, we did that ourselves. Cut it out and everything, laid it in there. I mean, it's not perfect, but it's better. Yep. So I, I put my arm around her, uh, Princess Faye. She sits right next to me. And that's why it's that way. We did that. This is the ignition setup.
Yeah, honey. Oh, she's still at it. And real quick, for you, those of you who like more modern vehicles. No, that wasn't factory. That's not factory. Oh, the, um, that ignition panel. That's where the radio used to go. It was the old AM channel changer, what? Spray bottle. Uh, partially, partially. The reason why we did that is because of the fact that uh, the ignition rod was acting up. And uh, it's hard to replace those old ignition rods, and I said, well, just screw it. So we went around all that and put in the button and everything else. No, you got it, baby. Looks good. And the reason why you would do something like this, one, all that oil and nastiness will just trap heat in. And this being an aluminum engine, you want that heat to dissipate. You want away from the engine because <laughs> Project Spirit. <laughs> no, this is Project Lena. And this car has been showed in car shows before. No, she's not won anything yet, but she will. She will. Uh, no, I am. Out. Yeah, that's that's from. Wasn't that like that when we got it? Uh huh. No idea where it's from. Oh, I hit a deer here and pounded the dent out myself. Broke my freaking headlight too. Yeah. Not my fault. That deer. You were there when it happened. That's beside the point. I'm still blaming you. The abuse. 67. Actually, the transmission that's in Project Spirits out of the 67 Mustang. Or 47, yeah. Yeah, the transmission in my car is actually older than my car. Poor deer. <laughs> no, it didn't kill the deer, but it mangled up the car good. There was some blood and fur on my car, which I was not pleased about. It wasn't my fault. Okay, I'm done. My arm hurts. Done? Okay. Well, I do need to move spirit. Back to her spot. Unless you're going to drive her. Nope. <laughs> oh. <laughs> she, Queen wanted to see you drive spirit. Sorry. That's not going to happen for a while. Spirit's a little, uh, little... It oh, did. It started towards me. When, you know, when a time. Yeah. We didn't do the brake job, LSB. We're going to have to take it to the shop. Yeah, they got That's it. That's okay, little... Gotens. Oh, he's got a good takeoff? Mm hmm. Okay. Well, go, uh, go, uh, you can't go anywhere just yet. You can't go anywhere just yet. He doesn't have a choice. He's oh. leaving. Well, dang it, because I know he would want to hear this. No, oh, I think different has the angry face. Yeah, we tried, though. We tried, but we just couldn't get it. Matter of fact, here, I even got a little dirty trying, and it just wasn't going to budge. We just don't have the tools for it. But I know what y'all want to see. I know what y'all want to hear. We know. Uh, don't walk too I know you know already, but... Just as a kind of, don't walk I ain't going past the door, so you're okay. you're fine. I think you'd be good to about the edge of the park, uh, the parking lot, but I need to move her to her regular spot. I'll shut the fuck up now. Nobody really came to it, so I just kind of shut it down. Uh, 
I was talking to the peoples. Okay, go tens. Yeah, my internet's not good for that type of a stream. Interesting. Huh? Interesting. What do you guys think? <laughs> Sean says your neighbors must love you. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you, Gotans. Gotan stayed for the, the vroom vrooms. Oh, he did? He stayed for vroom vrooms? <laughs> I like that, LSB. What did he say? Uh, he, LSB put emojis. You can look at it in a little bit. Okay. Mini lunch. You get to clean. I did the work. You clean. Oh. Don't forget the one behind you. Really? Really? <laughs> you talk like that to me, huh? Don't forget the sum over there, too. The what? Where spirit was. Oh, don't you even start with me, woman. That's empty, too. Bye, Gotans. Good to see you, Gotans. <laughs> Appreciate you being in here. He's probably laughing his ass off at us. One's empty. That's empty. <laughs> That's so good. Like Sean says she can still break them tires loose. Not bad for a 45-year-old uh, girl. Still got to wear a count. <clears throat> and that's the important thing. Oh, you got to be kidding me. Uncooperative. But someone else I know. Anyhow. Boy, that look. Like, really? You're going <laughs> to. I'm oh. not doing that on camera. Okay. <coughs> Dumpsters up there. Dumpsters. Are you taking over my stream? <laughs> oh, this is blocking. <sighs> Don't worry, I'll walk with you. you, can't. you Just can't. kidding. <laughs> You're killing. I know. Well, at least show off the car. <laughs> <laughs> he's so funny when he's aggravated. <laughs> It doesn't do as much as a, as much as I'm like, I guess I can do the rest of this. I'm not putting me on camera though. Just kidding, there I am. That's my screwdriver. He's not there yet. Okay. 
Got a small handful. We'll run these upstairs. Oop. That was my soda. I like stealing the stream from him sometimes. Okie dokie, Sean. Maybe he's not back yet. There he is. He's running. Look at him run. <laughs> Look at that jog. He's so cute. I'm getting too old for that. I was talking about the guy behind you. What? Just made you look. <laughs> like, my little hat kicks on his ass running up on me like that. Look at the kitty. Kitty, come back. Oh, okay, he's, she's gone. He's so cute when you run. <laughs> oh, I have your, I have your phone. I'm gonna take the gang with me. When did that happen? When did you get my phone? How long I have I not had my phone? Mama texted me. Oh, Mama never came to the stream. She went to bed. That was me. You don't want to see me. There we go. All right, guys. So I'm gonna go to take all this upstairs, baby. That's everything. Yeah, we're good. I guess we're out on the porch because I got my All right. So again, that proves my point that in, that a woman can work. She can, you know, Princess Faye works on uh, on cars, huh? You know. So we're back in the office. <sighs> I just don't have enough hands some days, you know? All righty. So, what do you guys think? Pretty cool? Pretty cool? My beautiful wife does, uh, you know, does work on cars. But I've taken a lot of trophies because of work she does, which is really cool. Uh, there we go. I'm too old to run. Gosh darn it. Hi, honey. Yeah, I mean, again, I, I'll tell y'all, um, I'll have to put some video footage up again, but or I'll post it to the Discord. But uh, my own, uh, Princess Faye, for a while, had a 77 Ford Maverick to match Project Spirit. And that was Project Vera. And uh, all the old timers, when we would go to a show, um, they were like, oh, yeah, that's so cool to see two Mavericks. And they'd usually start kind of looking at Spirit because of the, everyone liked that blue, you know, likes that blue on her. But then as soon as I would say what happened, uh, her frame rusted out from underneath her and her gas tank collapsed in on itself. So believe it or not, yeah, believe it or not, uh, that car ended up putting back on the road, putting three vehicles on the road, and one of them was a drag racer. Now, most people don't know uh, the the Mavericks all had a were notorious for right before the rear end on the uh, subframe, uh, the frame would rust out right there. Uh, but that you know, if you will, um, that that's a commonplace thing. Spirit is lucky because her inline six. Uh, the joke about her inline six is you check the gas and you fill it up on oil because it leaks like mad. Uh, that it, uh, about once a week we have to put a uh, we have to put a quart of oil in her. So because of that, the whole undercarriage is coated in motor oil, so she doesn't rust. <clears throat> Project Vera, that was uh, her engine was too clean, uh, other than just dusty and road grind. That you know commonplace stuff. Well, because of that, her, her, uh, um, 
her frame did exactly what you would expect for a car from Missouri. It rusted. So there's nothing we could do about that. But yeah, the engine went into, uh, it's actually still sitting there, but the transmission went into a drag car. Uh, the rear end went under something else. I forget. I think it was a pickup truck. And uh, they use that truck to pull just about everything. Hey, babe, the pig. Babe, you missed it. You, my wife was working on cars today. She was actually taking her around with our project cars and even worked on my 1975 Ford Maverick. Yeah, my wife can work on them. She's, uh, she's quite the mechanic. As a matter of fact, um, I was showing off some of her artwork on my car. Uh, she did the pinstriping on my car. That rear tail light panel, that's her work. Uh, she did that. I mean, my wife is quite the gearhead. I mean, she could do body work. Uh, she could do uh, she can do pinstriping and uh, she could she can do actual mechanic work. She knows how to change spark plugs in my car, change spark plugs, change the oil. Uh, she can, uh, of course, if you can change spark plugs, you can change plug wires. She knows how to do the cap and rotor. Uh, all that stuff. My wife is a very good uh, shade tree mechanic. Uh, and the department of, uh, of building them into actual hot rods, well, you know, that's not, that's almost a lost art anyways, taking those old cars and, you know, doing that sort of stuff. It's kind of a lost, a, a true lost art. And I know people still do it today, but they don't do it like they used to. So that style has kind of fallen to the wayside. But Princess Faye does know some of that stuff. She just doesn't know as much as, say, you know, someone who's been doing it for, you know, since they were 16. But she can do it. You know, she's quite a uh, quite the mechanic. Um, if it had not been for uh, the rust on the bolts, uh, she was going to be changing her own back on her car, a 2003 Pontiac Grand Am GT. So my wife can work on them. She is a very good mechanic and this stream has been focused on that fact that it doesn't matter your your gender if you want a custom car you can have it just get out there and do it learn as much as you can about your car learn what's in the aftermarket and you get out there and you do the best you can and a, a lot of even what you're going to learn is still going to be that process of you know you know, just kind of, you know, kind of going, you know, learning as you go, you know, so Princess Faye does, it does the work a lot of times. As a matter of fact, when uh, it came time for that taillight panel, she kind of pushed me out of the way and said, uh, you know, let me say right now, you know, basically she took the, she took the can of paint away and said, let me handle this little bit of business, baby. So the day that we filmed aircraft, the, the, the clip for aircraft remover, we were doing that taillight panel and she was painting that day. As a matter of fact, there's, uh, I'll have to again, post to the discord so you guys can, uh, nab it up again, but she was doing the painting. You know, my wife's, my wife's amazing. She's, you know, quite the gearhead herself, you know, <clears throat> well, she's more of a shade tree, uh, really. And I mean that as a compliment, a shade tree mechanic, um, you know, just being uh, the fact that she's a shit mechanic. I'm looking for my coffee cup right now. I have no idea where I put that doggone thing. Ooh, it's dark. I'm scared of the dark. Oh, there y'all are. Um, so, again, Princess Faye does her own. Uh, she does her own uh, mechanic work a lot of times. So, you know, go figure. Uh, my wife, actually the old timers out that my wife does mechanic work. The first words out of their mouth, that's a keeper. And then I look at him and say, that's why I married her. Yeah. The old timers, uh, in the hot rod community all think that because my wife can handle a wrench and doesn't, isn't afraid to get dirty that, uh, that she is, uh, that she is a true uh, classic among the uh, among the women. So there you have it. I mean, my wife can handle a wrench. Uh, you know, I'm a lucky husband. I'm a very lucky husband. 
<laughs> now, Queen, I know you're inspired. I know you're inspired. I know you could do it. And I know Babe the Pig. I mean, just it, she seems like the type that can handle a wrench. So, you know, there's there's nothing wrong with that. As a matter of fact, she has her own toolbox that I, I'm still going through and straightening out. She had a really nice toolbox set that I had uh, set her up, you know, set up for. Uh, but when we had Project Vera, someone actually broke into the car and stole her toolbox along with some other stuff. And she has been pissed ever since about that. Uh, we had some meth heads running around in the area just stealing stuff. And uh, eventually we busted them. And uh, while I was chasing them down, Princess Faye phoned it in. Yeah. And she's been very pissed about that. Um and then when Project Vera went away, we just drove Spirit for a while. Um, after, uh, and then Spirit had some problems and we got Project Lena. And uh, Project Lena has been an amazing co-star. Yeah, we chased it, we chased them down. Uh, 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 we didn't catch them when they did it, but we uh, caught them again, scoping out vehicles. And hey, Fleming, the ultimate grave taker. Uh, you missed it. My wife was doing work to the project cars. Uh, so you'll have to re rewind back, but there's a nice little, uh, as uh, Sean put it, a mini launch where uh, Project Spirit roasted her tires a little bit. A 1975 Ford Maverick with an inline six, all original engine basically internally, laid some rubber for y'all. And, uh, Again, my wife helps me work on these. Um, she, again, my wife's an amazing mechanic. Um, uh, I'll have to put it up on the Discord. I'll, I'll track it down. But there is actual video footage where my wife, three months pregnant, took the wrench from me and started changing spark plugs on Project Spirit. She took the socket wrench from me. And three months pregnant, didn't matter. Started turning wrenches. So if y'all ever wondered about, yeah, my wife can work on them. She's an amazing mechanic, amazing mechanic. Back then, I, uh, I, I, because of AA, I wouldn't show my face, but don't worry. You know who it is. <laughs> it's one of those things. You can't miss those, you know, you can't miss, you know. So yeah, my wife, she can, she's a great little mechanic. Now we started to change the, uh, the brake pads on her car today. And, of course, we got the brake pads right here, Duralask Golds. And uh, these are going to have to go over to uh, our friends at Torque Diesel and Auto, along with Project Lena. And they're going to have to break all that loose and get it swapped out, which it, usually they don't charge much anyways. But it, here's the general rule of thumb if uh, that Princess Faye has, because she handles all of that stuff on, on Project Lena. Uh, if I say, well, this is what she needs, uh, that's what we get. And pretty much after that, she handles a lot of the business end of it all. So if I won't take Project Spirit somewhere because I don't like the, the way the mechanics uh, treat Project Spirit, Princess Faye won't take it there either. Uh, so that's kind of the general rule of thumb. But she still has the option if she wants to take it to somewhere. Uh, but she, if I won't let them touch Spirit, she won't let them touch Lena. Uh, that's kind of the general rule of thumb. So if you find that interesting, I mean, you know, again, Project Spirit is, you know, one of those cars that, you know, that a lot of people fall in love with here on the channel. As a matter of fact, I don't think different is still in, in stream. And he'll tell you that's that's the car he likes. Uh, but believe it or not, there is uh, Project Lena does ha have her own cult following now. A lot of people like Lena, too. Uh, actually, in some cases, there are some people that like Lena more than Spirit. Um, now, for those that for those that are not in the know, Project Spirit is the car a lot of people wish they had, but Project Lena is going to be the car that most people are going to end up with, uh, you know, for their project car, something like that, because it's just so hard nowadays to find vintage steel like it used to be. Uh, it's just not like the old days. Um, in the old days, you could find that, and and I know think different in the group. You used to go out for five hundred bucks and buy a car like that, drag it home, 
in a couple months time you were driving it you know that's just how it was back then but nowadays you find a car like that they're a basket case most everything is missing you're going to pay anywheres from you know um 20,000 up for a complete basket case and all you're buying in a lot of cases is, is the body and frame and that body and frame really is not worth much to work on so that's actually about the norm nowadays someone long time ago asked me and said you know what are the chances of finding an original uh 1969 uh chevy camaro super sport that um that's you know in original condition i said good luck i i hate to be that one if you do find it you're going to pay because most everyone who's held on to something like that does actually know what they've got so um so again here we'll i'll take y'all with me we'll go back outside really really quick and my leg is all tied up in some cordage i need to straighten that horse shit out excuse my ladies We'll go back outside real quick since we've had some people kind of uh, jump in to the live. And, ooh, I was scared of the dark. I was scared. I was scared. We're all right. Anyhow, <laughs> here we go. And booyah! This is Project Lena. A 2003 Pontiac Grand Am GT with the 4.1, well, the uh, 3.4 liter V6 four-speed automatic transmission front wheel drive. One of the last of her kind uh, when Pontiac was trying to revive uh, their, um, their exciting side of uh, the Pontiac division. And this is what they came up with. Very stylish even now. Um, you know, and she does have the Ram air induction, uh, is very peppy for, you know, an inline six of her time and uh, pretty decent on gas. So not a bad car. This is, this is my wife's project car. This is her project car. So ladies, this is a, this is a woman's custom car, if you will. So. And then, of course, right down on the end is my car, Project Spirit. Ta-da! Here I am. <laughs> so, again, you can have a custom car on the on the cheap, you know. And, uh, babe, you'll appreciate this. My wife. Pretty well. All the work that you've seen in this live was my wife at work. She handled the, all the tools and the and the and the cleaners and and the you know the the cars all the car stuff that was done in this stream. That was my wife. Okay, I can't stress that enough. My wife does the work. You know. Yeah, she did the work in the stream. I've just been the idiot holding the holding the camera. <coughs> there. Go ahead, hold them up, show them. They're still a little, still a little dingy. That's that's gross. Oh. You want to show how to properly clean your hands after you work on cars? That's important. Might as well. Good idea. Y'all take a walk with me. We're traveling again. The office is a disaster right now. The apartment's a disaster right now. Right. Ooh. Oh, here we go. Orange. I do it different than everybody else because I have to be special because I combine it with other guys. Ah. <coughs> Look at your dad. Isn't that a cute little dollop? Yeah.
now you can really see the dirt coming up on your hands. <laughs> Babe's got the hand wash thing up there. You be careful. No. <laughs> there you go. I still got a little bit up there, but at least it's clean dirt now. Right. <laughs> clean hands. There you go. No, clean hands. hands. All right. So now you got, I mean, you could see, I mean, again, my wife gets out there and works on them. So when I say get out there and work on a project, that means all of you. So I'm a, I'm waiting to see what what you ladies will get for project cars now. Maybe you're inspired. That would be interesting if all of a sudden we had we had an entire lady car culture pop up here on YouTube, showing the guys up. That would be awesome. I would love that. I would love that. Uh, real quick, when uh. When Princess Faye and I both had Mavericks, the irony, you're going to love this. Uh, we were at a car show. I was in a different class and, you know, we were, we were in different car classes. We were actually it separated uh, where I was in the, the 70 to 76 range. She was in the 77 to 80 something range in her class. So we were separated um, because I was in that, uh, in that one I took second place in my class. Well, in her class, she took first. She took first place in her class. Um, and everyone asked me, does that bother you? I said, not at all. I'm proud of my wife. She put the work in. She put the time. She did all the stuff to make it, you know, to take first place in her class. I am not, no, I wouldn't dare take that from her. I was very proud of my wife. She did an amazing job and uh, on that car. And for her to take uh, first place in her class, that was awesome. <laughs> he probably looked at you like what hey what's going on sean welcome back welcome back queen b told the hubby that that she's uh that that she's gonna work help her husband with next time uh, next time it's time to work on the car that is awesome that is awesome i'm actually at uh, queen I keep waiting for you to uh, probably show up, you know, uh, to start showing off somewhere, whether it's on Twitch, you know, Twitch or here on YouTube. I got a funny feeling you're going to be showing everybody probably some dang custom car in about a year or two. <laughs> well, since we are in the office, I got my file right here and I got, you know, we already did this. You, know, you just lay it right in like that, and you just go back and forth till you cut that out. And then, uh, you know, so I, I know I'm good at filing. So that must, uh, so maybe I should try my hand at being a secretary because I'm good at filing. <laughs> I came in at the wrong time. <laughs> the running gags just keep on a coming. I got the. <laughs> myself for chat. <laughs> oh man. princess Faye uh has as soon as i showed her the last aircraft remover before it went up she's like no no not another aircraft remover and i'm like what you know and she's like no no she's like that it's it's getting to be an old joke and someone told me today they said how many more how many more? I said, well, everybody's still enjoying them. He's like, dude, it's the running gag that just needs to kind of stop. I was like, no. I said, everyone's still enjoying it. I said, the people have spoken. And he's like, oh, God. He said, you're just going to keep going with this till they're tired of it. I said, yeah. 
<laughs> but yeah, you know, aircraft remover and the filing joke. Because Sean likes the idea of me, you know, me doing some filing and then thinking maybe I should try my hand at being a secretary. <laughs> oh, but it's so much fun. So much fun. Actually, I'll show you guys something how uh kind of how uh I do things. All right. Secretaries cheat. No, they don't. Not all of them. All right. Let's see. There's. Hmm. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay, I'll tell you what, you guys are going to kind of see this happen. Here's my, um, my old computer with its, um, you know, with its editor. This is a very old uh, laptop, okay? And this is the movie uh, nine, Death of, uh, nine Deaths of the Ninja, okay? So all we got to do is find an explosion that we like. Or something. We find an explosion that we like. Okay. Split. We remove. Split. Actually, we don't need it. I got a better idea. Watch this. Okay. Split that, remove. Come down to a good spot to put it. We'll put it on the transfer. Hey, what's going on, sis? Okay, we close, close. We don't need that anymore because we got the clip that we needed. Then we can come down here Tell it that we don't want that. Right? And then we tell it that we want to eject. We pull that. <laughs> no, not anymore. This is the memory card that has the clip. Okay? Uh-oh. You better take it easy, sis. Okay, then we come over here. There's the funny section. Okay. There's the clip right there. We open it up with the editor. Just like that. There it is. And then we'll increase the volume. 
Come over here. We'll add in a fade. Fade in from black. Apply. Come down here. We'll add a photo or whatever we want. Come over here. And just like that, come down here, fade out to black. All right. And then uh, we come over here and there. Now, here it is. There you go. And that's basically kind of how it goes. That's actually how I do it. And it's a free editor, a Windows Movie Maker. Wait a minute here. You're gonna have to tell me the details, sis. Evidently, I missed something. So if you guys ever wondered, I mean, I'm not. that's not what I'm after here uh, because I need a slightly longer clip than that. But uh, you guys get the general idea. That's kind of how I do aircraft remover. And so it's just that one clip from, uh, from that day. So, uh, but yeah, Princess Faye got on... Oh, here. Uh, Princess Faye uh, didn't really like this one. But before there was aircraft remover, there was supposed to be something else. Look familiar? What happens when my cat goes uh, sadistic psycho? Our cat galaxy. <laughs> Secret. <laughs> oh my! <laughs> oh my gosh, that's great. Um, but yeah, all the clips. Uh oh. Ooh, yeah. That's not good. So, there you have. I mean, that's that's aircraft remover, literally. I just go around finding video clips that I like, and then I clip it down uh, how I want it. And then, you know, um, and then just put it with that clip. As a matter of fact, uh, the pod racing one is still, I'm looking right at it. I'm sorry, sis. You're gonna have to. You're gonna have to give me a call and give me the uh, details. Big brother gonna have to go down there and break his face. But here we'll get a better one. Open with. There you go. Hmm. 
Yeah, right now I'm kind of... Let's see, what would be a really good one for y'all? <clears throat> but we shall. Uh, do y'all want another aircraft remover? I mean, we're up to number, what, eight? Eight now? That was just weird. Don't you ever do that to me again. What? What did I do? <laughs> Leave the volume on from the stream. I was listening to you. <laughs> I'm right in the other room. <laughs> Henri. Henri. Oh. There we go. She's getting ready to play Animal Crossing. Hey, where, where are y'all going? Y'all almost fell over. Oh man, my sister's gonna be beating up on some dude running around. Hmm. Let's see. Y'all want another aircraft remover, huh? I know you guys do. You don't. You don't like aircraft remover anymore. I like it. It's fun. <laughs> right. Oh, man, this is going to be fun. Hang on here. I got it. Here we go. Move. Just for you guys, aircraft remover, other uses, number two. All right. So, come over here and there we go. Now, all I got to do is move that. And, of course, turn up the volume, make my adjustments. You guys are getting to see it. Here we go. Fade out. Black. Okay, there we go. And you guys can tell me if you like it or not, okay? So it'll be up to you guys to decide. Hey, TFZ Gaming, welcome to live, buddy. All right, you guys get to decide if this becomes the new aircraft remover. Yeah, I know you don't like it already, babe. All right. You guys ready? Here we go.
<laughs> Removes Jedi too. <laughs> what do you think, babe? Babe the pig, what do you think? Evidently that that what do you guys think? I have way too much fun with this stuff. It looks good. You guys like it? Of course, Princess Faye is tired of the joke. What are you going to do? Uh, we just uh, got through a little while ago doing some, uh, uh, print. well, I don't, I don't need to say we. Princess Faye was working on the project cars. Um... She was uh, uh, turning wrenches on, uh, well, she was basically tankering around with both Project Spirit and Project Lena. So you, you guys think that should be, a, think it should be an aircraft remover? It can be. We can make it one. Uh, let's see. <laughs> Honey, they're out voting you on it. Oh man. Well you got, you know we could we could keep this. <laughs> gotta gotta beat the tar out of that dude, huh? Running around with some gale. Sounds like it should be a country song. <laughs> Thank you. Watch with. Oh my goodness! You know, one of them things. One of them things. So Princess Faye does not like the new aircraft remover idea. <laughs> well, let's see. I got an idea. I just thought of one. Should be aircraft, right, guys? Should be aircraft of some sort. Uh, here. Mm. May have to may have to tinker around with this. But Okay, I got it, sis. Hmm. But yeah, I got it. I got it, sis. I'm one. We'll take a look at it. I'll be dang. Hmm. There it is. Split. Remove. This is this is where editing is so much fun. Mm 
Moo. And you got to keep it under 10 seconds here. There we go. All right, guys. I got the new aircraft remover. We're good. We good now. We Gucci. Add. We need aircraft remover. Okay. It's not completely done. But here you go. What do you guys think? <laughs> so that's the new aircraft. Daniel, yeah, I'm waiting to see what you have for comments on on it. Yeah. <laughs> now all I got to do is make the proper adjustments. You guys help help with that. Let's say if Gameron was in here, he'd he'd probably be like, oh yeah, we gotta do that one. Are y'all thinking what I'm a thinking? Hey, Crystal Teardrop. I didn't even know you were in here. Doggone, did you sneak in a minute ago or something? Shoot, I didn't even see it. I, I do have an idea, though. This, this gives me an idea. Yep, try to tell y'all. Well, we're going to be live for a little while, Crystal. We're going to be live, but I just had an idea for the new aircraft for the new aircraft remover. Just for you guys, you guys are going to love this one. Come on, there we go. Had an idea. I have an idea. Hmm. Where is that clip that I'm looking for? I'm looking for a specific clip. <laughs> I know, sis.
Hmm. Where is that spot that I'm looking for in this movie? See if this is it. Okay, perfect. No. Good to see you. Good to see you. Okay, let's see. <laughs> Aircraft removing. Oh, Crystal, you want to see? Hang on. We have that, but you will know when a when aircraft remover gets close to the end of the series when this is posted. Okay, when I oh shoot when you see this clip. When you see that one, we're about to make the grand finale because there's another one that comes right after that. And that's the end of the series. Um, <laughs> um, so yeah, uh, yeah, Sean. <laughs> How am I, Anna? I'm doing good. I start a three day weekend. Uh, so tomorrow starts three days off. I don't go back till Monday. Uh, so that'll be nice. And then I get to spend a lot of time with y'all. We're going to, we're going to find lots to do, but, uh, to answer. <laughs> human traffic oh <coughs> there was the time i almost got arrested for a joke i told a, i told a police officer i was a legal drug dealer and he looked at me funny and he's like excuse me i said i pass medicine in nursing homes and he's like oh funny funny guy <laughs> what 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 do you want me to take out <laughs> escape yes i have i haven't seen escape from new york i know exactly what you're talking about um hang on here Right. Fuck. And right there. Don't move it. Don't move it. Don't even breathe. There. Okay. I'm going to split it. We're going to remove this block now right here. All right. Aircraft remover nine is almost complete. Yeah, I know. I know. That's, that's Kurt Russell. Kurt Russell, if I remember correctly. But it's not a matter of, uh, you know, if it's, you know, keeping the, you know, if the series... Basically, when we start losing interest in the series, that's when it's time to end it. So. Oh, 
open. <laughs> okay. You guys are going to love this. Come over here. Get that clip. Make sure the volume is up. All right. You guys ready for this? The brand new. Awesome. <laughs> all right. All right. <laughs> all right. Hang on. Let me grab my. Oh, my gosh. What do you got? What do you got? A&R, what am I going to do with you? Oh, boy. Let's see what this is. I'm going to move this. No. There. Should I be afraid? I already know where this is going. Okay. So you want me to use that one? <laughs> I know ex I know the exact clip you're talking about. Yes, I will. I'll do that one just for you, okay? All right, you guys ready to see the new aircraft remover? Aircraft remover nine. We're on nine now. This is it. All right. <laughs> what do you guys think? <laughs> you can't get enough. All right. So we're happy with that. And I come over here. And I put it with the others. Actually, before I do that, I better, I need to do, I will need to do something. There. Hang on here. Oh, I goofed it. Okay. No problem. Well, that didn't work. That worked. Oh, hot, miserable day where you were at, Crystal. Well, we're going to do 
the same right there because what that actually does there we go and there we have it aircraft remover nine is complete all i gotta do is run it through my editor I'm a bad influence here. Yes, dear. too late for it right hey chairman welcome to the live welcome i didn't even know you snuck in on me i turned away for a moment you just ninjaed your way right in heck yeah well appreciate you coming in uh, you missed it earlier. Princess Faye was working on the on the project cars. That reminds me, Chairman. I've got some work to do on your. Uh, uh, I got some work to do for you. Uh, I'm pretty upset. Uh, you know. Yep. So everyone, just, everyone just got to see the new aircraft remover. I got something that I got to work on for you. Oh, real quick, uh, since Crystal is in here, um, I initially had uh, something I was going to put up that, uh, well, Princess Bay vetoed it. So this this it doesn't go up, but you're going to love this. Okay. Galaxy the Destroyer. Yeah. I like the idea. I didn't veto the entire thing. I only vetoed the freaking Enterprise. Stop twisting my words. Galaxy, st stop playing with the tools. One tough kitty, huh? <laughs> and I was like, what the? <laughs> what? <laughs> when you're done with your stream, we're going to have a talk about listening to what I'm saying, okay? So there you guys go on that. No, it wasn't ignored. Mm -hmm. It wasn't ignored. Mm -hmm. It wasn't ignored. Mm -hmm. I'm kick you. <laughs> <laughs> oh my goodness. All right, you guys ready? <laughs> so do I need to load this one here? We just we just completed it. Yes, please. <laughs> there you guys go. Now you know how aircraft removed. <laughs> we edited it right here on the live. And what I did was, uh, in case YouTube tries to say, oh, oh, you know, parody, I flipped, I did a vertical flip on it. Uh, no, I'm sorry, a horizontal flip through the editor. So instead of it looking like the regular, it's flipped. So now it looks a little different. So.
There we go. Everybody's put him a little buffering thing. Yes, yes, we know. Yeah. No, you're... We good. We good. All right. That last... <laughs> Last aircraft remover just about took out the stream. Got to be careful with that. Give it a second. Give it a second. It might be beneficial to, you know. Yeah, yeah. We're going to have to get ready to wind it down anyways. Um, yeah, sis, you're going to have to tell me exactly what happened, okay? Um, you got my number. You got my number, sis perfectly okay but you'll have to give me the uh, the gruesome details yeah we gotta start winding it down man uh i'm getting hungry i gotta go take care of me my blood sugar's getting a little low <laughs> right right hey honey could you hear me the, what the, the can the can No. Hand it to him. No. It's okay. So old, so tired. Gotta be careful with this stuff. Don't worry, I got the cap on. It's perfectly fine. Uh, but yeah, I keep saying uh, maybe I'll need to do this tomorrow. Call up uh, Rust Oli and tell him, man, you got some powerful stuff there. Go over to the Prince Magnum channel. You'll see what this stuff is. Man, this thing is taking out all sorts of stuff. I'll have to call him and tell him. <laughs> <laughs> oh, Pete agrees with you. He thinks the joke is getting old. Thank you, Pete. <laughs> Wait, isn't that your boss, Pete? Yeah. <laughs> but yeah, that's some powerful stuff from Rust Oleum, isn't it? I mean, you know, we know it's going to take out the Death Star. <laughs> you guys are awesome all right gang that brings us to our usual spot we will be live again tomorrow but we're going to try to do it at the the normal seven o'clock time so as usual all right unless something changes i'll post it somewhere <laughs> you'll supply more to keep it going <laughs> it took out the street all right guys i love y'all you know i'm thinking of you all the time so that brings us to the usual spot all right we will have a good night uh the usual spot as always get out there and work on a project you guys don't have any excuse do something with yourself all right remember idle hands and a creative mind go together like oil and water if you have a sweetheart sweep them off their feet do something special for them today and as always, even in these dark times, if no one out there has told any of you that they love you today. Prince Magnum does. God bless you and have a happy 24. Thank you.